Hi everybody, good morning. So, uh, this is Eli. Um, I'm doing a little, I haven't done uh, a YouTube channel, of course. Um, Weatherlicious, and I haven't posted, I don't post there that much, even though uh, the channel is has many years. I'm not there for any um, incomes or <laughs> any big numbers or anything like that. I'm just there to have fun. And it's just a fun channel, just random videos, uh, mainly about weather, but um, there could be some extra stuff in there. But anyways, I'm here because we are actually getting, uh, you know, getting, having a weather uh, condition that we usually don't get in my area here in, uh, I'm near Boston, just 15 minutes north of Boston. And we're getting sea effect snow. Yes, we are getting sea effect. I don't know. I'm not sure if you can see. It's very, very light. Uh, very light snow and flurries. Um, but yes, we are getting sea effect snow. Um, we are currently at a temperature of these other clouds coming from the Atlantic. Um, we are currently at 12 degrees. So it's very, very, very cold. So that my hands are freezing because I don't have a glove. Um, but, uh, yes, the wind is coming from the northeast, um, uh, right now, and it's going over some warm, uh, Atlantic waters right off the coast here in, uh, Massachusetts. So we usually don't get here in Malden, I mean Malden, just north of Boston, uh, we don't get CFX snow up here because, of, uh, when we get this cold blast of wind, um, the wind's usually coming from the north northwest or northeast uh we don't get a lot of east wind uh so if it comes from the north and or, uh, northeast it doesn't go over much water at all uh, northeast and east yes it will go over water but that means that the, any precipitation coming out of it uh, will be um will be falling in the southern coast uh southern east coast of massachusetts or uh, around the cape which they've had already some snow down there. I, I believe, I, I have to check the accumulations, but they've had accumulations down there because it's been snowing down um, mid Cape, I would say, uh, to a little bit of a Southern coast, uh, just South of Boston. Uh, I think Boston has had more snow than we have as, as well. Like from Boston South, um, have, they have been, get, have been getting snow since yesterday. Off and on, you know, not too, like I said, it's very light snow. Uh, this is no lake effect event um, but um, but yeah uh, I think it's cool uh, I've only seen it twice here um, in this area like I said we don't get a lot because a lot of the cold fronts will bring either north or um, a lot of these cold outbreaks will either uh, come from the north or northwest so a lot of the wind will come from there and it doesn't go over any uh, body of water um, so so yeah and when we get an east wind um, usually I will be with a storm to, uh, whether it's a nor'easter any low pressure system that will be to our south or just moving you know moving uh, up along the east coast and through this area then we'll get an, an, an east wind um, but of course that that's does not produce any CFX snow because it's already the low pressure itself is producing precip. So, anyways, uh, like I said, it's been really cold since yesterday. Uh, very strong, frigid, high pressure to our north, and um, we were supposed to get uh, a snowstorm today from that uh, North Carolina, South Carolina storm that just hit last night. Um, about I would say three days ago maybe uh three or four days ago this storm was supposed was was forecasted in a way uh in a sense uh the models were bringing the storm up the coast and towards us and we were supposed to get a really nice snowstorm we are under snow drought <laughs> um in my area in the Malden area we've gotten um I would say about six inches of snow. Boston did get from uh, the storm, I think it was January 5th, uh, which was our first snowstorm of the season, believe it or not. Uh, Boston did get almost 
a foot. I think it was 11 points something. So almost a foot of snow down in Boston uh, because of a band that is just not did not move at all. Uh, but we got a lighter amount. Six inches was pretty good. It was really nice to see snow. Uh, I like snow in the winter. It's winter. It's I want to see snow. I don't want to see, you know, anything else but snow. Um, but yeah, um, so yeah, we are on a snow drought. We, as you can see, there's no snow on the ground. This is ice, and the the few flurries that that we've gotten um, this morning uh, and this and, or, um, and last night. Yeah, um, that's that's all you're seeing right there. And this is because it's cold, obviously. But no snow, as you can see, it's just bare. Um, there so we missed this storm today as it moved uh to the east it did not move northeast um and they did say that uh a few days ago that it, we were not gonna get it but um you know i do like the, the few flurries um it's pretty it's you know it's what you know whatever it is i, I want to see snow <laughs> and as you can see uh i don't know if you can see any of it but there is a few flurries and the clouds are still here they're still moving i did see the radar and it seems like a little bit of this that's getting closer to the coast. Some of the wind have shifted to the uh, west. So if we do get a west, uh, I'm sorry, an east wind, we're obviously pushing this precip to the west. That means we'll, we'll be getting a little bit of more snow or light snow and flurries throughout the day today. We'll see. Right now it's just very, very light. Um, but yeah, uh, I hope we get some more snow. I am wishing for snow. I'd rather have snow than cold um, because it is really frigid right now. Uh, I think we're probably near zero for wind chill. My hands are completely frozen right now. Uh, but it is weird. Uh, hopefully we'll get some, uh, some more uh, snow. Um, they're predicting a snowstorm, I believe, is... The 30th, uh, these are model kind of predictions um, and forecasts. Uh, several models uh, are predicting the snowstorm. But this is like a week uh, away and anything, as we all know, can change. And uh, it could be beautiful and sunny, <laughs> but it is fun as a weather uh, geek and a weather nerd. Um, I love seeing, uh, I, I love seeing those, you know, forecasts extended forecasts uh forecast but but what i don't like is when the storm all of a sudden uh is not forecasted in the models and the future models uh a few couple of days before uh the date so that gets me really upset <laughs> because i want to see some snow uh of course we can catch up usually february is usually the month that we catch up to our totals for the for the season so we shall see what happens um, but anyways, uh, this is uh, Eli. I'm reporting from Malden. I am just north of Boston, uh, probably 10-15 minutes north of Boston, not too far from the east coast, uh, from the shore. Uh, I'm probably 15 minutes away from the, the coast here in Malden. Um, so anyways, I'll keep you updated. Thank you for watching this video. I will see you later.